A lot of people message me on how to set a two-stroke engine, like for a chainsaw or a weed eater, to run properly at idle and at full throttle. I'll show you how. So I'll use this still weed eater as an example. First thing you do is make sure it's running. Well to do that you don't know where to set the screws. Well, turn both screws. One's marked, marked H, one's marked L. L means low speed fuel adjustment, H means high speed fuel adjustment, and the other one is idle speed. So turn them all the way until they shut off, back them out about two turns. It's not totally accurate, but most machines will run on two turns. Then choke your machine, start it up, get it warmed up for, you know, like 30 seconds to a minute. Try, make, see if you can get it to rev full throttle. So if your muffler's not clogged and the machine has the potential to run correctly, the compression's good, the carb's not bad, it's not losing, you know, suction because there's cracks in the hose, everything's A-OK, -okay. well, then get it to idle by turning the idle screw, but not idling really fast, idling almost as slow as you can make it idle while it still idles. Don't touch the H screw yet, just turn the L screw, and turn the L screw till it starts to run the fastest. Then you might want to readjust the idle again, what seems like a good idle speed. Then readjust the L screw, screw again till it runs the fastest. And then when it starts to run the fastest, open it up a tiny bit more so there's a little bit more fuel and then stop. Next step is give it full throttle while it's running and adjust this till it starts to four cycle. That means it sort of runs choppy and it seems like it's running at half the RPM there's a longer space between the fires. Then slowly turn it in while it's running full speed until it smooths out and runs at a very high speed then stop. Then give it lots of quick revs and see if it doesn't go blah, blah, and die out. Let it idle a bit, rev it again, check for it bogging. If it bogs a whole lot when you first punch the gas, doesn't seem to want to pick up the revs, take the idle screw and turn it out a little bit more and make it run a bit richer. They need to idle a bit rich so that it sort of primes the crankcase area with extra fuel so that when you punch the gas they don't die. Now if it's running and able to run smoothly at full speed, it doesn't sound like it's four cycling, take it into the grass or get your chainsaw and start cutting wood. You may have to do the final adjustment while you're actually operating it to get it to run with full power and perfectly smooth, not four cycling when it's under load. Also when you're using it under load, just before it when it's idling and you're revving it without a load, same as your chainsaw, you want it to almost four cycle, which means it's slightly on the rich side, because if it isn't slightly on the rich side, as soon as you actually start using it, it will start running smooth, but it might start running too smooth and lean right out and then lose power. Of course we have some random cottage popping by. Never fails. Have fun kitties.